On behalf of Accept Credit Cards, welcome to our video on completing your PCI compliance. To get started, simply click on the link in the middle of the video or type in our website exactly as it appears, elect-mer.com slash PCI. Once that page loads, scroll to the bottom and click where you see, click here to begin. The portal page will ask for a username and password. Your username is your merchant ID number, which can be found on your most recent merchant statement. And your password is your federal tax ID number. If you're having trouble logging in, give us a call at 1-800-476-5020, option 3. Upon successful login, read over the terms of use. Then, check I agree and submit. The following page will ask you to change your password. Make sure it is something you will easily remember, such as your business telephone number. Feel free to change or update any information on the verification page. For any major changes such as address, give us a call so we can update your merchant account as well. The final two questions on this page are mandatory and should be answered no and no, just as shown on this video. Now it is time to get started on a new SAQ. Unless you have a database that stores credit card information electronically besides the virtual terminal, you can easily select no for the next question. Then, select the form of transaction that best fits your business. Choose the proper terminal type on the SAQ selection page. This video will cover the SAQ CVT for our virtual terminal products. For video tutorials on any other questionnaires, just click on that button in this video. If you're unsure which SAQ to complete, give us a call at 1-800-476-5020, option 3. Now confirm your selection. The portal will bring up a window with to-the-point questions that will help you pre-fill the real questionnaire. Just take a moment to answer each question, yes or no. When you're finished answering the last question, simply click Submit at the bottom, followed by Continue. Answer the highlighted yellow questions. If any of the questions seem unclear, click on the blue question mark. If the following page does not contain nine check marks, please give us a call. Otherwise, just click Submit My SAQ. This will bring you to a confirmation page. Simply fill out each field and then click Complete My SAQ. Congratulations, you've now completed your SAQ. We will get back in touch with you next year to complete the process again. Thank you.